All right, folks, in this video, a buddy of mine from New School Fishing, I'm going to put a link up here to his YouTube channel. Be sure to check it out and subscribe. He messaged me early in the morning and said, hey, man, I got a monster fish. It's bottomed out my 50-pound scale. Do you have a 100-pound scale? Uh, are you home? Are you near the lake? And luckily, I was heading to the lake to go fishing that morning. So I made sure I had my scale, made sure I had batteries in it. Headed down to the water to see what New School Fishing had put in the boat. This is kind of like having a baby. You really don't know what you're going to get until it shows up. So let's see what we got here. What's up, playa? What's up, man? I just said in my video, this is like having a baby. You don't know what you're going to get until it actually gets there. Ladies and gentlemen, new school fishing. <laughs> The yeah, man, the legend. It's pretty dark out here. Well, you know, we at Dieter Melhorn Fuse fishing use the ultimate in photographic technology to document. I actually can't say you believe it or not. It's you got not, the ISO up on that thing? Yeah, it's cranked. That's... All right, folks, I get messages quite a bit uh, from folks to uh, come down to the boat ramp. I don't have a scale. I think I got a monster. And uh, sometimes you get there and it's a good fish. Sometimes you get there and it's a small fish. Well, as soon as the boat got close and I looked in it, I knew this was a good one. I knew he needed uh, something bigger than a 50 pound scale. And uh, I was excited to see what this fish was gonna weigh. It looks kind of big. There, get some light on. You got real luck? This ain't gonna flood you, is it? No. Matter of fact, if you got, it's probably better light to back out. Oh yeah. That is what we call a pigus. Nice one. What time did you catch it? And I caught this thing at like 3.30 this morning or whenever I texted you. That's when you texted me, okay. You got an anchor rope and I yelled at them to come help me. And they pulled up, they knew who I was. They said, uh, they said, we watch you and do your mail one. Whoop. Yeah, that one right there, dude, he's going to go at least 30 pounds. <laughs> go at least 30. I'm never wrong on my estimates, by the way. He'll go at least 30. All right. We need fish grips, don't we? Tell you what I do. Weigh him in the net. That's going to be the best thing on a fish that size. Put him in the net and... Picture. Hang on, hang on. Let's okay. spin back around. Let's go ahead and get the love. Let's get the sexy shot. Wow. There's some boys getting ready to blast off in a tournament in about 45 minutes. That would probably pay you about four or five hundred bucks for that <laughs> fish. There's some boys out the Mississippi River monsters that would want that fish today. That's a stud. Make sure it clears everything. It 12 pounds, 5 ounces. 12 pounds, 5 ounces. I told you. Oh, I was wrong. Reset the thing. I don't walk into the lake. 24 kilograms. Is it in kilograms? It's in kilograms. Ah, oh, dang it. That'd be like 60 pounds, would it? Let's change it out of that. <laughs> Let's get some real English on here. Wait that thing in English. Yeah, make sure it clears everything. 61.4. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Well, sure enough, we waited a couple times. We waited a couple more times off camera, and uh, it was right at 60 pounds. That's a great fish. It's a trophy fish. It's a tenth of 1%. Uh, you are in the top tenth of 1% on Lake Wiley when you catch a fish of this size. It is a true trophy, a true fish of a lifetime, especially in our reservoirs. There's other parts of the country well, where that may not be the biggest fish in the water, but around here, you're in the upper echelon. You get one of those in a tournament, they're rarely ever weighed in that size. And when you put something like that over the side of the boat, you know 
you've got a true monster. Zero it out. Sway it one more time, just to make sure. One, four. There you go. Find a sweet. The pig. That's a pig. right there brother yeah. he's getting ready to release himself <laughs> and like all good fishermen we got it back in the water we got it released alive. Uh, congrats, pat on the back to uh, New School Fishing with a great fish and a great live release. Uh, that is awesome. Took a lot of care of that fish to keep it alive, get it weighed, make sure it got back in the water, swam off, it was in good shape, and uh, an awesome fish. Be sure to check out his channel, New School Fishing, here on YouTube. Uh, I'll put a link down below. There's also a link at the beginning of the video to his channel. Be sure to subscribe. He's got some great stuff. Uh, putting out more and more content and I'm always excited when I get a little notification bell that he's got a new video up. Hopefully you like this video, you like the channel, and if you do subscribe to my channel uh, and if you do hit that little bell so you'll be notified when new videos come out and we look forward to seeing you on the water.